Good morning. Good morning. Happy Saturday. Good morning. <laughs> Hi guys, good morning. I just did my skincare routine, wash my face, brush my teeth, brush my hair, put some Olaplex in, but I'm really excited to bring you guys along on today. Um, today, me and my mom have to get groceries and we wanted to stop by a Home Goods. Um, my mom's office makeover, we're shopping for that today. Um, she got a little office at her job and so me and her wanted to decorate it together. Um, so we're gonna do that today and we're gonna shop for it. We're gonna go to like Home Goods, Target, and the dollar store for that and we're really excited. So I'm really excited to be bringing you guys along for a little vlog. I haven't vlogged in a minute um, as far as my filming goes. So I'm really excited to bring you guys along. I think that's what's on the agenda today. Also, we're watching skating championship for U.S. Nationals to see who's going to the Olympics in terms of like men and stuff. And there's also a 90% chance of snow this afternoon. So that's what's on the agenda. So yeah, without further ado, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Isabella. I make lifestyle figure skating and vlog content. And be sure to subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any future videos if you haven't already. And let's get into the vlog. Lit. I need to bundle up today because it's so chilly out. Um, so let's see what we're gonna put together. This is the plan for today's outfit. So I'm just gonna wear my thermal undershirt with this Sherpa pullover with a beanie and some gloves. And then I'm gonna just wear these pretty warm, actually, like little leggings. I'm gonna toss my giant coat on when it starts snowing, but as of right now, I think this will just be fine. And then I'll just put the gloves on if my hands feel cold. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm all ready to head out with my mom. I just tossed on my outfit, feeling good. Um, and yeah, let's head out the door. So me and my mom just sat down to eat a little bite for lunch. We got some ramen to share. We tried a little bao and we split some sushi. So it was very filling. Probably will hold us over till like very late evening. But we are about to head over to TJ Maxx, Sierra, and Home Goods because they're all in like the same little area as Whole Foods right now. Um, and then there's also a little boutique here, so we might pop in and check it out. But we're just having a nice. up here at TJ Maxx. Mostly we just got stuff for my mom's office makeover, but we found a couple of little um, Valentine's Day things. Um, so we're really excited, but now we're gonna head to Target. So we're pretty much almost done with all of our shopping for today. We just had to pick up a few small things today. Nothing really too much um, along with our weekly groceries. Um, but we are going to make one more pit stop at the dollar store and pick up a couple of little knickknacks. Um, my mom also just ran in to go grab some flowers for a friend. So we're going to 
just cap off the day with that. Guys, look at how pretty these flowers are. They're so beautiful. I love flowers. It is literally a winter wonderland out here. The snow is coming down. I love it. It feels so good and amazing because I absolutely adore the snow. <laughs> We are home now. We actually made quite the array of stops for our errands today. We're basically just trying to get everything done for a few weeks so that we don't have to go out and run and get a bunch of stuff. So just wanted to get everything done today, which was very productive. I think I'm just going to give you guys a quick haul here. Um, we got a few Valentine's Day things, so I'm going to save that for like a different video. Um, but I just thought I'd show you a couple of little knickknacks that I picked up. Um, and yeah. First up, Sephora. I ran out of my some of my things this week, and so I just thought I would replenish, refill, just get it all set because their products usually last me a couple months since I do like to use them sparingly and just, honestly, you only need a little bit. So um, I just picked up my Drunk Elephant Polypeptide Proteiny Cream and my Virgin Marula Oil for my face, so. Sephora actually gave us a lot of knickknacks today as well. We got this little fresh hydration box. I think it has to, I think it correlates with like their points or whatever. And then this little packet with a bunch of samples. So I have a few new skincare products to try, which I'm really excited. It's my favorite thing to try out. I have actually been doing it for a solid year now officially on my skincare journey and it's been really fun. So that's all we got, um, but now I'm going to show you guys a couple things that I got from Target and TJ Maxx. I have been wanting this for the longest time, and a lot of them are actually quite pricey, so I've kind of been scouring around a bit. But today in the little bullseye's playground section, I found this little bath thing where you put it along your bathtub when you're taking a bath, and you can have your candle or your iPad sitting or like your book sitting in front of you. So, this was such a great find. It was only $3, and I love it. It's just, it's perfect size, and it's very minimal, and I've been looking for one of those for a while, so very glad that I was able to find one. Um, They had, like, a little Lululemon dupe, so I thought I'd try it out. If it doesn't work out, then I'll return it, but it's just an Align Tank dupe. It's a little bit different from the Align Tank, but it has built-in sports bra and stuff. I just got a small from the all in motion and just a black color. I think it'll work out good, but if it doesn't, I'll return it. Um, but I just wanted to try that out, so I bought that. And then, this actually correlates with Valentine's Day, but I thought I'd just give you a little sneak peek. I found this little raspberry white chocolate hot cocoa bomb. I am the biggest sucker for raspberry paired with chocolate, plus white chocolate's one of my favorite all-time chocolates, so. I am so excited to try this. And final thing that I got from Target, I am trying to hop on my reading game this year. I am the biggest book nerd ever. Um, and I'm just trying to get to 50 books this year. So I got the Friends Forever. I actually read Friends. It is such a great book. Um, I mean, Real Friends. It's called Real Friends. And then I got Friends Forever. Um, it's like a sequel to real friends and I'm really excited to read it. So yeah, that's all I got. I also got a power bank because I've been needing this lately. I don't know, my phone just like runs out of battery a lot. So I also forgot one last thing from TJ Maxx today. I found the Quip floss string. This is really portable and nice. Actually, I realized that's pretty much all that I got that does not relate to Valentine's Day or office stuff. We didn't really get too much today, but we definitely went to just pick up some essentials. Uh, we found some Valentine's Day stuff and, of course, the little office makeover stuff. So, it's good day, good success all over. Now, I am going to make dinner. I actually got inspiration to make chicken parm because I saw a bunch of YouTubers do it. I, like, saw it day after day. A bunch of the YouTubers that I'm watching just, like, made it. So, I'm just going to take it as a sign and make it for my family tonight. I'm really excited. I haven't had it in ages. Um, so, yeah, let's make it. This is basically the meat of everything you need to make chicken parm. You just basically need some chicken, mozzarella, breadcrumbs, sauce, and I like to pair it with spaghetti and a side salad, but we're also going to coat our chicken, so I'm going to take you guys along. <music> So guys, 
it just about sums up that vlog. I hope you enjoyed. I really did have such a great time taking you guys along. So fun to go to Whole Foods, try out their little ramen bar that they started doing. I didn't know they had like little restaurants in them. I always knew they had like great like little food bars with really great meals and stuff, but never been to their ramen place or like a restaurant and it was very delicious. I was amazing um but thank you so much for coming along if you enjoyed be sure to leave a like and to subscribe down below so you don't miss out i'm trying to hit 100 subscribers by the end of january so it would mean the world to me if you did um and yeah without further ado thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye guys